In this video, I will show you how to fix if Valorant is not opening. This should be a quick and easy tutorial to follow, but before we do continue, please consider leaving a like on the video and also subscribing to the channel. I really do appreciate it. Now, there's a couple of things you can try in order to fix Valorant and get it working again. So starting with the first method, what you're going to want to do from your desktop is come down to your search box in your taskbar at the bottom. In the search box, go ahead and type Valorant, and then you should see Valorant come up underneath best match. What you want to do is right click onto this, and then on this menu, click onto open file location. Then what you're going to want to do is right click again onto Valorant and this time you want to come down and click onto properties. If you don't see properties come and click on show more options and you should see properties down here. Once you've done that the Valorant properties windows go into load through and what you want to do is come up to the top and click onto the compatibility tab and there's a couple of things you're going to want to do from here. So first what you're going to want to do is tick the box to run this program in compatibility mode and leave this set to Windows 8. Also you want to tick the two boxes down here to disable full screen optimizations and to run this program as administrator. Once that's done click apply and OK to apply your changes. And once you've done that, you can close this window down. Now, after doing this, what you want to do next is come back down to your search box in the taskbar at the bottom. And this time you want to go ahead and type services and then open up services underneath best match. What that's going to do is open up your services window. In here, you want to click onto any of your services and then press V on your keyboard. Now, this is in alphabetical order, so it's going to take you down to everything labeled with V and you want to search for something called VGC, which stands for the Valorant Game Client. Now, what you need to do is actually click to select it and then right click onto this and on this menu come and click onto properties. What you want to do is come to startup type and this is generally going to be set to automatic or manual. So if it's set to automatic you want to change it to manual. If it's set to manual change it to automatic. Whichever one you change it to what you want to do is once you've made a change, click on start, then click apply and OK. And the final thing I would recommend doing is coming back down to your search box. And this time you want to go ahead and type graphics settings and you should see graphics settings come up underneath this match. Give that a click and that's going to open up a window like this. Now what you need to do is come and use the search box down here and in here type Valorant. You should see Valorant come up. And what you want to do is click onto the drop down arrow and basically your GPU preference, you want to change this to high performance. Generally it's going to be set to let Windows decide, change it to high performance, there's no save button or anything like that, you just need to change it, close this down and what you can do is try Valorant again. If it's still not opening, if you actually double click to launch Valorant and when Valorant launches through as soon as you, you've double clicked to open it, if you hold down Alt and Enter to enter window mode, Sometimes that can fix the problem as well and cause Valorant to launch successfully. So that's how to fix Valorant not opening. Hopefully one of these methods has helped you out today and you can now stop playing Valorant again. And if this did help you out today, then I would really appreciate it if you was to consider leaving a like on the video and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this tutorial and I will see you in the next video.